This video explains and demonstrates the effective use of SafeExam Browser SEB in combination with the UTest platform to create a secure and reliable environment for online exams. Let's start with enabling SEB. You can start creating a test as shown here, and on the Settings tab, click on the Show Advanced Settings, and then select Enable Browser Lockdown. Choose Safe Exam Browser. When you finish the test wizard, you can also change Safe Exam Browser settings. Navigate to the Settings tab. Go to Security Settings. Enable or disable Browser Lockdown. Choose the Safe Exam Browser. Optionally upload new configuration file. View the name of current default configuration file. After the test is configured with the desired settings, candidates will be required to access the test using the Safe Exam Browser. When candidates click on the Start button, they will be automatically redirected to a page where they can. Download the Safe Exam Browser if it's not already installed on their device by clicking on the provided button. After installation, initiate the exam by clicking on the Open in Safe Exam Browser button to launch the browser and begin the exam. Click on the Leave button. Click to confirm and open the test in the SEB. Click on the Yes button to terminate listed applications before starting the test. Upon confirmation, candidates will commence the test in Safe Exam Browser mode. The test will be displayed in full screen mode and they will be restricted from performing other actions. The candidates can view the report in the SEB environment after completing the test as well, as you can see here. In the case that a candidate is using two monitors, they will be unable to take the test. A message will appear on their screen that explains to the candidate the two possible options they have in this scenario. Either disable the second monitor for the duration of the session, or exit the SEB environment. If the candidate accepts the condition, the second monitor will be turned off and the exam will commence. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.